Hi there! For some time now, we have been planning to do a product comparison of what actually we think should be the default sum of options for the top models in H0 scale. Therefore, we decided on this V90 based on the similar construction characteristics between these two brands. And that's why, right from the start, we have an equal score of 2, because both models offer similar concepts for the first options. A first difference is made by ESU, where the sprung buffers are not only a very nice functional detail for any model, but they are a real advantage on tracks with a very small radius. In terms of traction and stability, both models offer almost the same thing, the difference is being easy to be ignored. In regarding the capacitor option, no comments from us, just Izu does score again. The detailing is generally good, but again we find that Izu did not hesitate to go to a maximum accepted by them for the price for what is called an absolutely decent and successful detailing, while Trix, using the same project from 5 years ago, has certain ignorable minuses of detailing and even severe leaks, like those reported at the cabin window in the recent video dedicated to their model. The light scheme is acceptable and of a good level for both models, the difference being made by the different maneuvering lighting accordingly the two eras they represent. The cabin light is as well fitted as it should be on absolutely all models currently produced in Europe by all manufacturers. The situations changed massively from the lights options where both the dashboard lighting and the additional lighting in accordance with the original already bring a large difference score in favor of ESO. In terms of driver in the cabin only Trix scores but it is worth noting that this is the only ESO model that does not have a driver in the cabin. Again, we come to the lighting and score increase in the case of sparks imitating the braking sequence and again ISU distances itself by options strictly specific to this brand. The same happens for the automatic curve sensors. Regarding digital couplers, both models offer satisfaction and good operation through their features, where it is worth mentioning that both models work only with couplers dedicated to the installed digital coupler types and that only two years ago ESU solved the problem of compatibility with the universal coupler type, while Trix type coupled but does not uncouple the universal coupler type. By the smoke generator option ESO scores again and we will mention that the dynamic smoke generator has already been established as standard for this brand. In this video it is also worth mentioning that ESO offers a universality between power systems, their locomotives being ready to run on both Marklin and analog dioramas DC or DCC, while for Trix we actually have two factories and two brands for the same model, so they can be used strictly either on the Marklin diorama or on the other analog or standard digital dioramas.
In the end, the prize, where Trix wins, but let's not forget that the list for the ISO is much more extensive in functions and equipment through their offer, where the curve sensor will offer much more easily perceived functionality compared to the mobile mechanic of Trix. The final chapter is sound quality. You better watch out for what follows because it's like significant as possible to understand the balance of forces. Even though in this part of the video it might seem that the sound is similar, we think you already perceived the difference in quality between Izu and Trix on separate stock. But to fully demonstrate what we want to signal and what will somehow fix the final score, let's watch the sequence with the two active models with their sound turned on at the same time. The final score will be 15 to 10 in favor of Ezu, because we gave an extra point for the mobile function of the cab driver to Trix, but also a point for Ezu for the exceptional sound quality offered and still with their old decoder. Finally, we challenge you to immediately imagine your favorite model from your collection and place it comparatively between the two columns, which in our opinion represent the ideal digitized and functional model of these years. Until next time, be safe and well, everyone.